Hi, my name is Mass, and today we're going to talk about how to integrate WISE into a brand new Unity project. What you'll see here is the WISE launcher and the Unity Hub. What we'll be doing is that we'll install Unity from the Unity Hub, and then we'll show how the Unity project is appearing in the WISE launcher, where you can open both the WISE project, Unity project, and integrate WISE into the new Unity project. So go into the Unity Hub and click New, and then give it a unique name, and then click create project. This will take some time. So now you've got a brand new Unity project, but WISE is not yet installed. So next step is to install the WISE Unity integration. To install that integration, you can just close this project, go to the WISE launcher and head in to the Unity page. You might notice that a new Unity project has appeared and that's the unique name project. And here we got three options. One that is grayed out because we haven't made a WISE project yet. You can open the Unity project and you can also integrate WISE into the project. So let's do that. And here you'll have a few things to design on. Make sure all the integration packages are selected. And in the deployment platforms, you need to select all the platforms that you intend to build games for. So if you are building a game for Android, you need to select that as well. For now, we just got the Mac and the Windows platforms selected. And then you can just click integrate. This process may take a while. Once that is complete, you'll see a green box. And since you now integrated WISE and created a WISE project automatically, you can now open the WISE project. But let's just head into Unity to take a look at the integration. And instead of going to the Unity Hub, you can just open it from the WISE launcher. What you might notice is that there's a few new things here. Now, if you look in the hierarchy, you'll see there's a new game object, a WISE global game object, which is where you define how much memory you want to allocate for audio assets. And in the bottom, you'll find the WISE picker. If the WISE picker is not showing here, you can go to window all the way to the button and choose WISE picker. And in the WISE picker, you will have access to the entire WISE project. So all the events or game syncs that you add to the WISE project will be shown in this WISE picker. And from here, you can just drag and drop that into your project. Additionally, you also have the option to create sound banks from directly inside Unity. That's it. You can now start making your own game. If you want to learn more about how to use WISE in Unity, check out the WISE Leo 1 certification.